Hey there, Budget Epicurean here, and today I'm bringing you a super simple two ingredient recipe for bacon wrapped asparagus. And of course, all you need is some bacon, and you can also use turkey bacon if you don't want to use beef, totally fine, and asparagus. So, springtime is when asparagus is at its freshest and it's available, so we're gonna use this beautiful vegetable to make an awesome little side dish. So, when you get fresh asparagus, the first thing to do is to cut off the hard bottom of the stems. So you just take a bunch and about an inch from the bottom, just cut those stems off and this bottom most part is going to be tough and crunchy and you don't want to eat it anyways so this just helps to keep the most tender part of the asparagus as the part you're going to be eating and for those of you who have uh, dogs I don't know if yours will but try it out I know my dogs love the bottom part of the asparagus they think it's just the greatest treat in the world so I like to save those ends and uh, give it to them as a treat when they did something good because um, I figure before they were domesticated, dogs were wolves or whatever they were and they just kind of ate whatever plant food was around so if the asparagus is good enough for me, it's good enough for them. So if they like it and it's pretty healthy for them, then more power to them, right? So we've got our nice freshly cut asparagus and if you're not going to use all of it all at once you can actually uh, put these in a glass with some water in the refrigerator with the stem down and they will keep fresh for much longer in the fridge than if you just kind of threw them in a bag and left them in there so helpful hint in case you're not going to use all of your asparagus at once then we're going to take our bacon and I'll take three or four stems of asparagus, enough for one nice little appetizer. Take one strip of bacon, and starting at the bottom, I'm just going to wrap it around like so. Okay, then I'm gonna put these little bundles in the oven at 350. I've got a cookie sheet on top of a baking sheet so that as the bacon cooks the fat can drip off of this little bundle and um, not not just be swimming in it like it would if you used a flat baking sheet to cook them and these are also great for grilling um, for the same reason because the fat can drip down off of it as it cooks so there you have it simple two ingredient little appetizer or side dish great for summertime grilling or wintertime in the oven or anytime really these are just delicious so make them for your next party and watch how fast you can get people to eat their veggies Thanks for watching! If you want to know more, please go check out my website, www.budgetepicurean.com.